Hey guys, I'm Anarchy, bringing you the salt. And I'm fucking Goblin and Green. And man. we fucking come here today for Pissed Off Nerds. I know it's been a while, guys. But holy fuck, is it worth the wait now? Mm, when so man, do we have some crispy trash to talk about today? When, when something bad comes out, it needs to be talked about and it needs to be torn apart! It's fucking awful. So, most of you might have noticed that mm. there's a new NBA uh, Spider-Man uh, commercial. No! Those two things should not go! And th they decided that with the NBA to do a Spider-Man trailer mm. inside the NBA commercial. Actually, which clearly works well. Yeah, and but some people are saying, ah, oh, it's just an NBA thing. It's not to promote it's so Spider-Man. Stupid. Even though it has the date of Spider-Man under it, so it's clearly meant to promote so Spider-Man. It's stupid! It's it's fucking. All right, fucking so let's eggs. just let's just let's just you know what we're not even let's listen. Okay, so basically here's the whole deal. So uh, starts with Happy and Tony Stark uh, with wardrobe stuff, oh, uh, and they make horrible, horrible, unfunny garbage jokes. It's you know what's funny is it's not even um, it's not even that the jokes that they make aren't funny even though they aren't. It's that they've done them before. They've done them before. It's Marvel! They use the same joke every time! Happy's dumb and lazy, Tony's smart, and, and fucking lazy. And and bitch. Oh, so funny! Great! Awesome movie, guys! So basically, <laughs> here's the deal. So basically, the motherfuckers are like, So look, we got Spider-Man here. He's and, not babysitting. And he needs to be babysat by Happy, because he's not a fucking hero. He just needs to be babysit by Happy. Sure! Alright. The guy who ruined Mandarin's great to babysit Spider-Man! They send Spider-Man to get some crackers. Yes, some beautiful crackers. Cause Great party. Yeah. Wait, I thought Tony Stark was a fucking millionaire. Why, can't Why does he need a Spider-Man to go get his fucking crackers? Why can't fucking anyone, one of his assistants, do it? No! Nope. You, you know what? Spider-Man's the same as just an assistant. This is the same. Yeah. Yep, Spider-Man's the same. Spider-Man is Iron Man's assistant. Same thing. He's not even a superhero. He's Spider-Man's assistant. So anyways, Spider-Man goes and gets crackers, and they have this lame CG. Oh, oh my god. That's just a pile so of shit. And, and when he talks, the mask doesn't even move too much. <laughs> it doesn't move correctly. It's, it's, just, moves, oh, oh. it's weird. And he's like, next to a criminal on a Samsung Note 6, yeah. because we need to throw that advertising in there, and too. And then they drop the TV, and they bust it. Ah, uh, why? Wonder, this is an ad for that TV as well. I feel like the whole commercial is an ad. They have the crackers, the TV. This uh, fucking the phone, bullshit. The phone. The Samsung the phone. 8. Okay, this is like advertiserception. There's like 50 ads in one ad. And on top of that, it's an ad for the NBA. That's an ad for Spider-Man. Right. That's an ad for a fucking phone. That's an ad for a TV. That's an ad for the crackers. That's an ad for DJ Khaled. It's one big cluster fucking shit! And for all of you who are going like, well, it's not part of the movie, it's not an actual trailer. That's the point, is that it's not an actual trailer. They actually agreed to do an NBA commercial with Spider-Man! You know what? With fucking Spider-Man! Yeah, you know you know what's the most bullshit? Is, um, is the fact that people are confusing this and thinking all of it is clips from the film. Yeah, which is fair because it does look like the movie. It does. It looks I, like a I pile was, of shit. No, no, listen. I, I can totally see. They have a joke with the NBA, and the rapper shows up, and Stan Lee shows up. That commercial actually fits in the context of the MCU. That's how lame the MCU is. Yeah. Is you can totally see DJ Khaled in there. Yeah. Oh, oh, the fact that people are actually questioning if this is actually a trailer, I'm not surprised either. Because Marvel is that shitty with their jokes and shit, it actually looks like it's part of the movie. Because it is such a shitty looking movie. And every trailer that's come out for Spider-Man Homecoming has been shitty. It's shitty. Just, it's shitty. Uh, oh my god, and what's worse is they've just been, like, it was constantly the worse. First, the first one was bad. It was bad. It wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't like... It wasn't like mediocre. It was like we can, we can, we maybe. Like, it's bad, but it was like the Marvel kind of yeah. brand of bad. Really, like, that's bad, but at least I can shut my brain off and fucking <coughs> not even think about anything. Yeah. Right. And then the second one comes out, and it's fucking worse. And you're like, oh my god! Not only are they making a shitty movie, but they're also shitting on 
Some Spider-Man. Spider-Man is Spider -Man, Spider -Man, greatest villains and pretty much making him do an Iron Man. His entire universe in general. And then the third trailer was for Iron Man 4. Yep, it's Iron Man 4 with Spider-Man as a fucking sidekick. It's a sidekick. It's Spider-Man. I love to call it. And now the fucking NBA commercial. It just seals the fame of Spider-Man Homecoming that it will be the second worst Marvel movie on my list probably. Hey, Real, like legit, they really need to try to be worse than Iron Man Three. They do. They really like they this. Do. Need there needs to be effort. At, at the end of the point. movie, Vulture just pulls off mask. He's like, I'm, I'm an actor. An and, actor. Then, and then a guy in a suit comes in with no wings, and he's like, oh, I'm actually the Vulture. Fucking. Ah. Hey, remember when? Remember when we thought the Vulture was gonna have like the Vulture wings? Don't Instead worry. The, the tips are. The tips are Vulture wings. Don't worry. It's Green Goblin with uh, tips. They even do the scene with the fucking jetpack that goes through the beams and he jumps over yeah. it. Yeah. I swear. Okay, listen. If in Spider-Man: Homecoming the Vulture impales himself using his own wings or something, I'm out. I'm, I'm done. I'm, I'm fucking I'm done. done. Fucking walking. No end man. credit scene. I'm done. If I see. Any other Avenger, I will be dead. Even the Captain America one, it's that's fine. That's fine. As long as he's not showing up like, hey, how are you doing guys? He's like, I'm the hero of this movie! You're my fucking sidekick! Sit the fuck down, you useless! I'm taking your suit! Fucking sit the fuck down, you're worthless! The best meme to come from the Captain America cameo in the trailer, which by the way, the point of having cameos is they're fun and they're a surprise, better show them in the trailer! Yeah. Anyways, um what's fun is like the memes that came out of it, it's like, remember kids, if you want to be strong. Get some drugs in you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so let's just get right in to the actual comments. We have comments from actual people who don't know whether the fuck they're talking about. Just roll comments. Alright. So let's start with the first one by hashtag PHI. Great channel. I'm ready. Give them to me. That's some quality marketing there. Fuck that. <laughs> Awful marking. First of all, Spider-Man looks like shit. Absolute shit. The whole scene is retarded. It's got even worse comedy than their normal Marvel movie. And that's saying something because Marvel's comedy is awful. Uh, it's not good marketing because it's so obvious what it's doing. It's a, they have hashtags in the corner of the day Spider-Man's coming out. They're trying to make it... They're trying to make it amusing, but it's not. It's lame. <coughs> I pretty much... If I wanted to show someone what Marvel was, the movies, I would show them the NBA this, Spider-Man trailer. This, this explains exactly what Marvel is. No other trailer, commercial, or anything has shown what Marvel is. It's even got a... As a movie studio. It's even got a Stan Lee cameo in it. Like, oh, it's a commercial! It doesn't need Stan Lee in a fucking commercial! What a waste! Ha! <laughs> it says, uh... Uh, Candle Movies says, That MJ fake-out, though... <sighs> I get it, because it's Magic Johnson, not Mary Jane! It's so funny, because they're going to have a female character oh my God. in Spider-Man Homecoming that's probably not going to be Mary Jane. It's probably going to be some new character that has nothing to do with the comics at all. Uh, because <laughs> fuck the comics, because we're Marvel, and we can do whatever the fuck we want, and, and you suckers will either. buy it! You'll just buy it! Because who cares? But whoa, 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 whoa. Batman kills and Batman Oh, kills. shit! Can't Holy shit! That. Can't do it! That's fine! But Superman, Superman's a little dark! Nope! But but Vulture's Iron Man's villain. That's fine! Right. Right. Whatever! Right. Iron Man but gets Spider-Man his suit. But he's in Spider-Man! Whatever! He's, he's good! He's in Spider-Man's movie, so he's <clears throat> Spider-Man's villain. That's not his... He holds a helmet! It says, I'll get you Iron Man! What the <laughs> fuck? That MJ joke was amazing, LMAO. Shut the fuck up, you easily amused fucking piece of shit. If What's you're... not funny? Lame. If you're... Lame, 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 lame. If you're 10 and you say the comment, I can... And it's, look at this guy. He looks like he's fucking like in his 20s. <laughs> and he found that amusing. It's lame. <laughs> okay. Fuck. <laughs> It's fucking all awful. Okay, what's next? Let's get oh, yeah. Let's just fucking steal no, 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 no. Tom okay. Holland makes Spider-Man great again. This has 202 likes. I want to flip the table in it's, fury. You know, just... Mm. It's awful! First of all, I the only good thing about Tom Holland's Spider-Man that I've noticed so far is that he actually sort of looks like a teenager. That's it! That's all I'm going to give him! Is he sort of looks like a teenager! All the other Spider-Mans look too old to be Spider-Man. But Andrew Garfield performed Spider-Man the best. That's it. He was the best Spider-Man. And Tom Holland looks like fucking he's going to be awful. 
Hey guys, I'm looking at a woman. <laughs> oh my god, I'm going to Tony, Tony Stark's party! Oh my god! I'm going to Mr. Stark! I'm going to Mr. Stark's party! It's not, it's not Mr. Stark, it's Mrs. Stark. Mrs. Stark? You can't, like, separate Mr. and Stark. He says Mrs. Stark. Because like Spider-Man can only be a teenager. Yeah. It's not like he's ever been grown up. Dude, they could throw a wet dildo at the screen in the middle of the movie. People would be like, That was great! It was so funny! Oh my god, I love Spider-Man Homecoming! So intelligent. That's a lot to say. Mar Marvel's so relevant that they can yeah, have they could, the they NBA. Could, they could do whatever they want, man, because you know what? They're hip, they're hot, they're awesome, they're fun, they're happy! I'm halfway <laughs> expecting to see Spider-Man with a fucking fidget spinner. Oh! Halfway expecting that. It's gonna happen now! He's gonna get a Spider-Man fidget spinner! And he's gonna be like, oh cool, look at it! I flick it and it moves! And, and then I flick it and it moves. Dude, this Spider-Man Marvel Marvel is the epitome of the minions from Despicable Me. Oh, they're bad. That's what Marvel is. They're like, oh fart jokes and shit, great, funny. Ha ha! Excuse me, but this is high class humor, okay? Do we have another comment? Yeah, oh yeah, we do. Let's um, get... You are doing good, Sony. Keep doing good. Sony already did good with Amazing Spider-Man. And this is, uh, has a uh, 117. Is what? Sony even doing this for a minute? I thought it was Marvel. It's a Sony studio that's doing so it. So Sony's just like... They're hey. both doing it. They're both involved. But Sony owns the rights to Spider-Man. Still. So Marvel's doing it, but Sony's just kind of there because they own the rights. Yeah. So Sony didn't actually do anything. This is empty. Aside from be like, here's Spider Man, and <clears throat> yeah, no. So this guy doesn't even know what the fuck he's talking about. He doesn't even sell him. They just give him just Marvel. This is Marvel. Another one. That MJ part got me so hyped. Oh! oh my God. Why? Uh, I get they're trying to be funny, but it's not funny because MJ is a good character that can be done well, unlike these characters in the Marvel universe. So it's kind of funny that way that they're trying to reference good characters over their horrible characters. Yeah, good, good job. Good job, Marvel. Good job. Fucking ruining another hero. This come. Your point is... Yeah, they do use too much Robert Downey Jr. to a fucking movie. You think? Maybe! Maybe! They use too much. <laughs> if he fucking says, with great responsibility comes great power, I'm gonna fucking lose my shit. Especially just... coming from him! The guy! Who gets drunk in a suit and kills him! in it! And gets in a fight in his own house and almost kills oh, a bunch of people. Me, it's with great power. Who gives his addre address to terrorists to come and blow up his house? Listen, Happy wrote that movie. So that It doesn't excuse <laughs> any of it! It is connected, <laughs> is it not? It's part of the Marvel. <laughs> Apparently not, because he got a suit back in fucking <laughs> the next movie. Because they were like, that there you go! Forget the third no, one! See, Marvel decides what works and what doesn't work. They decide. Because they're the gods of Marvel. Uh, like, the big message of this trailer wasn't even, like, watch Spider-Man or watch the NBA. It was, look at DJ Kelly! Oh my god! Jokes! Colors! More jokes! 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 And nothing else! Because all, that's all they have. Even this TV spot has a Stanley cameo. What a waste of a fucking cameo. Fucking seriously. Stanley! Fucking in a fucking NBA you know commercial. What? If you look at it, right? Yeah, I know. If you look at it, there's no like other indication that it's in the, he's in the same scene as Spider-Man. So I feel like they just wasted their Stanley cameo. Yep, yeah, I, I could be, yep, yeah, I know. That's so bad. Mm, you see that? I know, that's fine. Oh, I'm so fucked <clears throat> You think, hey, you remember when they said Stanley was pre-filming all his cameos? Do you think he pre-filmed for the NBA cameo? Yeah. <laughs> Fuck, definitely. You, he could, Fuck. you know what he should do? Just, like, go on a green screen, right? And film multiple <clears throat> reactions and just, like, list every Avenger. Like, he's like, oh, look, Iron Man. Oh, look, Hulk. Oh, look, this, this, this. Like, give him a list. <laughs> and he says, oh, look, A, B, and C. In front of a green screen, and you just Photoshop him into every movie after he's done. You don't even need to keep the green screen people to be like, Oh my god, it's silly! It's not a soft card! Oh my god! Fits in! Someone apparently wants fucking Scarlett Johansson there. Okay, awesome. 
Yeah, that's what we need. Another fucking Avenger in a Spider-Man movie. I'm, uh, that's it. That's all I'm willing to read. Thank God. All right, well, uh, as you guys can probably tell from this video, we're not happy and we're not excited for Spider-Man at all anymore. I mean, like, we weren't before, but we're still going to like see it like and give it a chance. Get ready. It's out next week. Right. Well, that, get ready for that review. I'm oh, sorry. No, in two weeks. Well, get ready for that review because... You know we'll be reviewing it and fucking dying inside, and we'll probably <laughs> hate ourselves after. There'll be some crying during that review. The only thing, the only <clears throat> joke they can ever do in in that movie that'll make me laugh <coughs> is if the vulture goes to McDonald's because of the founder. <laughs> so uh, I have a question. What do you think? Is this is this like our first Marvel review since Marvel Month? I think it is. It's our first Marvel video, yeah. Like since Marvel Month, yeah, like since it ended. Oh, and what a way to fucking Our study. first Marvel movie's gonna be fucking... Actually, no, we did Guardians. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, well, we did a good one, at least. We still have Doctor Strange to do, so... Ah, oh, don't fucking fuck! Dormammu! Anyways, great, great. This is gonna suck. It fucking sucks. NBA sucks with this. It fucking... So what I'm gathering is you like it. I love it. It's so great, you know. Yeah. It's, it's so great how they just take a good character... That's been done well in some of the movies. Spider-Man 3 stuff. And they fucking rip it to shreds and fucking ruin it. And then everyone loves it though. Everyone's good with it. <clears throat> but Batman kills. And that's unacceptable. But that's Spider-Man's a little so bitch. Weird. But that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. All right, well. It's supposed to be a little bitch boy. I enjoyed this. Not really. I kind of hated it. And also, I kinda, um, also like, cry just one more thing. You have too many heroes in New York City! Yeah. Like, what? The rest of the world is probably getting butt-fucked while the Avengers yeah. and every I'll, fucking I'll, mother okay. is in I will tell you all the heroes that are in New York City currently in the MCU, okay? We're gonna go for it. Well, not New York City, but, you know, uh, you know all, all, America! Harlem, everywhere, around the New York area. Okay? Uh, Spider-Man. Uh, Iron, the Avengers fucking bases in New York. So all of those fucks, Hulk, all of them, uh, Daredevil, Punisher, Luke Cage, <clears throat> Iron Fist, and Iron Fist. Don't Fuck the rest that. of the states. Yeah, all the rest of the countries. I mean, like maybe Black Panther once in a while, or you know, oh, yeah, maybe Scarlett no. Johansson's Black Widow on a spy mission. Did you see the Black Panther? Nope, I don't need to. We, we gotta do trailer talk. Oh, uh, we do, don't we? Mm. Oh! Uh, yeah, uh, be prepared for, uh, <laughs> just, like, a trailer talk and then a pissed off nerd about fucking Black Panther. <laughs> <laughs> trailer talk slash pissed off nerd. Just, oh, my God. That's, All right, let's, 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 that's just, we're done. Stuff. We're done with this NBA right, bullshit. Do, do your, uh, I'm Donnie Green and I'm fucking pissed. I'm Anarchy and I'm bringing you the salt for pissed off nerds. This is us and we're pissed off because this is shit. Fuck.